Welcome to High Score! Welcome to High Score, the show with more games than you can waggle a joystick at. I'm Julia Reed, and today our four soldiers of fortune will match wits, bits and nerve to battle it out for high school glory. They'll find out if all that time spent playing video games will finally pay off. First, let's meet today's protagonist, and as always, our resident announcer, Johnny Showbiz, will do the honors. Johnny! Thank you, Julia. Here are those protagonists. Number one is Alex Allen, who likes to think of himself as 007. He's a 30-year-old barman from Crofton Park and enjoys Tekken and has always wanted to be on a game show. Well, welcome, Alex. You're on one now. Number two is John Moran. He's a photo lab assistant who likes rock and roll and used to play in a band. Number three is Adrian Archer, who's part Barbadian, part Canadian, and he lives in East Ham. He enjoys comics and almost fell into a ditch in a car. Our fourth contestant is Ben Tunnicliffe, fun-loving Kiwi Ben, now lives in East London and works in IT support, and he's a big fan of West Ham United. Hi, guys. Welcome to High School. Alex, have you been on TV before? Uh, yes, I have. I've been on TV once before. I was <laughs> actually in the bill. For a few little shots. Of that's course. All. What character did you play? I was played a football hooligan. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. John, how are you doing? I'm all right, yeah. A bit nervous? A little bit. Getting into it. Okay. Raring to go. Good luck. You'll yeah. be all right. Adrian, you're into role-playing games, are you? Oh, yes, I am, yeah. Oh, yeah. Wicked. Japanese. The Japanese ones? Yeah. Oh, I say. Ben, <laughs> hi. How are you? Glad you're here. <laughs> right, you've met the players. Let's find out what they're playing for. Is this how your evenings are? No mates, no life, with nothing more to look forward to than the company of the TV and a cup of cocoa? Well, that could change by winning the high-score large bounty of gaming prizes with a street value of over two grand. You'll be the envy of the mates you never had before. But be warned, the bounty could render you absolutely irresistible to the opposite sex. And there's more. For when the guests go, you'll have the chance to high score with Lara and Brittany. Good luck. We start things off with Button Bash. Questions from the world of games, movies and music. It's two minutes on the clock, five points for a correct answer. An incorrect answer means you're frozen out of the next question. If you're ready, please start the clock now. Robbie Williams sang the duet Something Stupid with which Alex? Carly Minogue. Incorrect. Anyone else? Ben. Nicole Kidman. Correct. Five points. Well done. Which ill-fated Apollo mission was the subject of a film starring Tom John? Thirteen. Correct. How many shields were there in the original Space Invaders game? Ben. Four. Correct. Which Disney character starred in the video game Going Quakers? Quack Attack. Adrian. Don't duck. Correct. In 1998, Stardust insisted that the music sounded better with who? You. John. Correct. You, baby. Name the 1995 science fiction film which starred Keanu Reeves as a man who downloads data. Alex. Johnny Mnemonic. Correct. Name the captain of the USS Enterprise in Star Trek. Ben. Captain Kirk. Incorrect. Your friends now, Alex. Uh, Jean-Luc Picard. Correct. Who played Truman Burbank in The Truman Show? Alex. Uh, Jim Carrey. Correct. Well done. Which TV series featured the characters Captain Apollo and Lieutenant Starbuck? Alex again. Buck Rogers. Incorrect. Which TV series featured the characters Captain Apollo, Adrian? Oh, God, about a Star Galactica. Well done. Fine. <laughs> Name the 1987 film starring Kevin Costner as Elliot Ness. Nobody? Ben. Dancing with Wolves? Incorrect. You're frozen out. Anyone else? Kingstone. A Adrian, sorry? Kingstone. Incorrect. It was the Untouchables. Alex, you're back in. Name the cartoon builder who had a number one single. John. Bob. How could it be anyone else? Bob, correct. What name was given to the beach volleyball in the Tom Hanks film Cast Away? How did you call the ball? John. Wilson. Correct. In which country was Leonardo DiCaprio's The Beach primarily filmed? John. Thailand. Correct. Whew. Well, after that button bashing frenzy, let's look at the scores. Johnny! Yeah, let's look at the scores. Everybody scored. John's in first place with 25. Alex is there with 15. Adrian's got 10. So does Ben!
Well done, everybody. Level two is called Screen Test. Name the game by watching a short video clip and buzz in at any time with your answer. Each contestant is only allowed one guess per clip. It's 10 points for a correct answer, and you can earn yourselves an extra five points if you know the year of first release. Contestants, are you ready? Please watch this screen to my right. Ben. A Crash Bandicoot? Correct. Well done. <coughs> Ten points. And the year? Uh, came out 96. Very well done. Bonus points for him as well. Let's have screen test number two, please. Adrian. Pokemon Battle. Pokemon Stadium Story. Incorrect. You're frozen out of this clip. Oh, Anyone yeah. else like to buzz in or should we see some more of the clip? Let's have some more. John. Super Smash Brothers. Super Smash Mario Brothers. I need a little bit more. <laughs> Two, uh, Super Smash Mario Brothers. No, I can't Two. really give that to you. I'm sorry. Okay. Anybody else or more of the clip? Ben, Alex, more of the clip. Let's have yeah. it. More of the clip. Oh. It's a tricky one. Anybody? Oh. No. no. Super Smash Brothers Melee in 2001. Oh, melee. Clip number three, please. Come on, come on, pack your bags. We're going home to our planet. <laughs> and the time is up. Oh, that's wonderful. It's on the PC and the Dreamcast. Yeah. Anybody? I can't always call. <laughs> Stupid Invaders. Oh, yeah. 2001. <laughs> Can we have the, the next one, please? Ben. Uh, it's Daytona. I need uh, a fuller answer um, than that. Uh, no. Nope. No, You're frozen on. out. Let's have a small clip. Adrian, go on then. Daytona, USA. No, I need an even more complete answer than that. Let's have some more clip, please. Remember, guess. Daytona Alex. USA 2. <laughs> no. no. John, please. Daytona U USA 2001. Well done, but you have to buzz in. Uh, Say it again. Daytona USA 2001. <gasps> well done. Do you know the year? 2000. Spot on, bonus points. <laughs> Finally. Whew. After that, Johnny, let's have a score update, please. Score update! Here we go, John! Pulled into the lead. With that big answer, he's got 40. Ben's got 25. Alex with 15. And Adrian with 10. Now it's time for level three. It is time to play Picture Arcade. Contestants have to identify a picture, but there's a catch. Each picture has a different point value attached to it. Get it right and you win that number of points, get it wrong and you lose the points. And each circle can only be chosen once. The player with the highest score goes first and choose wisely because at the end of this level, it's goodbye to one of our contestants. Right, John's our leader at the moment, so he'll be making the first choice. John, what do you reckon? You've got a reasonable mm. lead on the rest of them. I'll go for five, safe. Five? Say. Yeah. Just the five? Yeah. Coward. Let's have that safe. picture. <laughs> <laughs> oh, um... Oh, man. Dagna... Dagnasty. <laughs> no! You're wrong! It's Mutley, the sniggering Mutley. dog. Bad luck. Well, quite good luck that you only chose five then, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, who is up next? That'll be Ben. Uh, I'll go for ten points. Ten points? Yeah. Okay. Let's have the picture, please. Who's that, then? Any idea? Looks a bit like you, actually. <laughs> well, no, it's not Indiana Jones. It's, um, it might be. Indiana Jones. <laughs> yes. Yeah, I'll do it. Yeah, it will be. Oh, <laughs> Indiana Jones. <laughs> well done. No worries. My mum's in love with him. <laughs> Like okay, she's not here. <laughs> it should be kissing you. Right, Alex, you're up next. Sorry, Mum. Uh, I'll go for 30. Might as well. OK. 30. Bold mover. Let's have the pitch, please. Oh, which one? Who's that? 
<laughs> I, was, I thought it was Terry Wogan this night, is it? Sorry? I thought it was Terry Wogan. No, no. it's not Terry Wogan. It's, it's actually uh, <laughs> Gary Kasparov. Oh, okay. Ah, okay. Adrian, what's uh, it going to be? Number 25. 20, you're, you're going for 25. If you lose this, you'll be on a tie with Alex in last position. Okay, and then we'll be going to a tie break. So let's see the picture. Who's that? He looks slightly squashed there, doesn't he? He's normally quite a handsome chap. Any idea? No. It's Tanner. Okay, so we have ourselves a tie-break situation. Both Alex and Adrian are now on minus 15 points. Guys, I'm going to ask you both a question which is worth five points. If you buzz in, you get it right, you get the five points. If you get it wrong, you're going to lose those points. Okay, everyone happy with that? The question is... Amped on the Xbox is what kind of sports game? Nobody knows? Snowboarding. Adrian, correct. It is a snowboarding game. So, Johnny, where does that leave us with the scores? The tally looks like this. John and Ben both have 35. Adrian's still there with minus 10, but it's sayonara to Alex. Oh, unfortunately for Alex, it's game over. Well, we've still got three contestants and three exciting levels here to reach on high score, so please stay with us because we'll be right back after the break. Yeah.